The automotive industry is witnessing a revolutionary transformation driven by the rapid adoption of electric vehicles. Amid this change, companies like BYD Company Limited have emerged as key players on the global stage. Originating from China, BYD has emerged as a significant competitor in electric vehicle manufacturing, challenging the supremacy of giants like Tesla. In this video, we will explore the rise of BYD, its innovative strategies in sustainable mobility, and how it has forged a worthy competition with the pioneer Tesla. In a scenario where the electrification of transportation redefines industry standards, BYD Company Limited is a Chinese company headquartered in Shenzhen, Southeast China, a modern metropolis connecting Hong Kong to the mainland. BYD Company Limited specializes in manufacturing automobiles, rechargeable batteries, electric buses, and other energy-related products. The name BYD comes from Build Your Dreams, reflecting the company's vision of driving innovation and sustainable development. On the other hand, the Tesla company is also dedicated to the same business area. However, the Chinese company BYD sold more electric vehicles than Tesla in the last three months of 2023, as the two companies fight for first place in the sector. BYD said this Monday that it had sold a record 526,000 vehicles in the last quarter of 2023, the first in which the Chinese company's sales surpassed those of Tesla. But despite this feat by the Chinese company BYD, throughout 2023, Tesla sold more vehicles than its adversary. On Tuesday, Tesla said it had delivered 484,500 electric vehicles in the final three months of 2023 and 1.8 million for the full year. A few months ago, BYD surpassed Tesla in quarterly production. Its success is a sign of the growth of the Chinese automobile industry, which in 2023 overtook Japan to become the world's largest exporter. It's a bright spot in a sluggish Chinese economy reeling from a severe housing crisis and record unemployment. As the world moves towards new, cleaner technologies, this is another example of how difficult it will be for Western countries to wean themselves off of Chinese products. How BYD realized its aspirations. From the beginning, BYD had a unique advantage. Unlike car manufacturers that diversified into the production of electric models, this Chinese company initially specialized in battery manufacturing and later ventured into automobile manufacturing. BYD CEO Wang Chuanfu, worth approximately $18 billion, was born in 1966 in Wuhei County, a region under the direct administration of Wuhu Prefecture City on Hue Province, People's Republic China. Originally from a farming family in one of China's most impoverished provinces, Wang was orphaned in his teens and raised by his older siblings. After earning his bachelor's degree in metallurgy engineering and physical chemistry, he founded BYD together with his cousin in Shenzhen in 1995. The duo rose to prominence as producers of rechargeable batteries used in devices such as smartphones, laptops, and other electronics, competing with expensive Japanese imports. The company went public in 2002 and quickly expanded its operations by acquiring Qingchuan Automobile Company, a struggling state-owned automobile manufacturer. At the time, electric vehicles were in a nascent stage, but authorities in Beijing were looking for an opportunity in the market that China could take advantage of. In the early 2000s, the government prioritized renewable energy production, implementing subsidies and tax benefits. For BYD, this was the right moment. The batteries they manufactured became the fundamental drivers of electric vehicles in an emerging market. In 2008, Warren Buffett, the wealthy American investor, acquired a 10% stake in BYD Auto. Anticipating that it would eventually become the main player in a global automotive market that would inevitably move towards electrification. His prediction turned out to be correct, as China currently leads the world in electric vehicle production, largely thanks to BYD. Beijing, aiming to maintain this leadership position, recently offered tax breaks totaling $72.3 billion to electric vehicles over four years, the most significant stimulus at a time when sales are experiencing a slowdown. Analysts suggest that BYD's growth is largely due to its original activity in the battery space. 
Since batteries represent one of the most expensive components of electric vehicles, manufacturing them in-house represents considerable savings. In contrast, competitors like Tesla rely on third parties for battery production. According to a UBS report, the BYD SEAL model boasts a 15% lead over Tesla's entry-level Model 3 sedan, made in China. BYD's entry-level electric vehicle, the Seagull, costs $11,000, while Tesla's recently launched Model 3 sedan, with a starting price in China of nearly $36,000, shows a marked price difference, surpassing more triple the BYD model. Furthermore, in early 2023, BYD managed to overtake Volkswagen as the best-selling car brand in China, demonstrating its success beyond the electric vehicle market. BYD vs. Tesla During a television interview in 2011, Elon Musk scoffed when asked about BYD and Chinese competitors. At the time, Tesla was a relatively young publicly traded company and had just unveiled the prototype of its first car, the Model S. Today, Musk probably regrets his initial response. Ironically, Tesla is being credited for the growing popularity of electric vehicles in China. Green incentives failed to encourage customers to buy electric vehicles until the arrival of Tesla. Tesla has become one of the favorite electric vehicle brands in China and is highly preferred among younger buyers. When China, the world's largest automobile market, sought to boost the adoption of electric vehicles in the country, it relaxed regulations to allow foreign companies to have full ownership of manufacturing and sales operations in the country. Before this change, companies like General Motors and Toyota needed a local partner even to establish a factory in China. Tesla took advantage of this opportunity and, to this day, is the leading exporter of electric vehicles made in China and the second largest seller of this type of vehicle in the country. Will Chinese electric vehicles win the competition? The outlook is narrowing for traditional automakers, whose business still relies heavily on combustion engines. Analysts anticipate a significant shift by 2030 as environmental incentives increase in response to climate change. European and British manufacturers face challenges in staying competitive. However, distrust of China could result in regulations that make it difficult for Chinese manufacturers to access the European market, despite their competitiveness. The European Commission has launched an investigation to assess the possibility of imposing tariffs aimed at protecting European electric vehicle manufacturers from an avalanche of cheaper Chinese imports, backed by subsidies from Beijing. This scenario could follow the pattern of how the solar industry was affected by China's unfair trade practices. Although there is this regulatory uncertainty, so far, BYD's green and affordable cars are experiencing success in Europe, where they face challenges such as inflation and high energy costs. The competition between BYD and Tesla in the electric car industry is interesting and constantly evolving. Both companies have played significant roles in driving electric vehicle adoption, although they have different approaches and strategies. Tesla, led by Elon Musk, has been a pioneer in the development and commercialization of high-performance electric vehicles, with a focus on battery technology and vehicle autonomy. The brand has established a strong global presence and has become a benchmark in the industry. On the other hand, BYD, a Chinese company, has gained recognition for its comprehensive approach to electric mobility, encompassing not only vehicles, but also batteries and other key components. BYD has been successful in the Chinese market and has expanded its operations internationally. In terms of sales and global presence, Tesla has been the leader, but BYD has made a considerable impact in China and has proven to be a force to be reckoned with. Competition between both companies has stimulated innovation and development in the electric vehicle industry, benefiting consumers with more options and technological advances. But now it's your turn to tell us, what did you think of this competition between companies? We will be attentive to read you in the comments. If you found the video useful, we would appreciate it if you gave it a like to support our project and if you subscribe. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.